Hello, welcome. Pause the video, try the problem out, and then press play and we'll solve it together. All right, so in this problem, we're trying to figure out if this is true or false. And this type of question is really testing our understanding of the law of logarithms. Now let's just start off by saying what this is. This is actually true. This is a true statement. The log of the product of a and b equals the log of a plus the log of b. This is a fundamental law of logarithms. And <clears throat> we're not going to prove it in this video, but let me just show you that if you're dealing with a problem like this and you're not really sure if it's true or not, try things out, right? Try values of a and b to see if this does in fact make sense. So right here we have the log of a, b. So this is the common log, it's the log of base 10. So let's look at the log of 1,000, right? That's 10 times 100. So in, in my case right here, I've just chosen some friendly powers of 10. I'm dealing with common log. And here, the first 10 is just 10 to the first, and this is 10 to the second. So this is my a equals 10 to the first, and then my b equals 10 to the second. So does this, in fact, equal the log of a, which is 10 to the first, plus the log of b, which is 10 to the second? Well, let's see if this works. Well, the log of 1,000 right here, this, this part right here, the log of 1,000, that's just the log of 10 to the third, and that is equivalent to 3, right? So this is actually equal to 3. And that's equal to 3 because if I rewrite this, this is a base of 10, 10 to the third, equals 10 to the third, right? In other words, the base here, 10 to this power 3, is 10 to the third. What about the log of 10, log base 10 of 10? Well, that's just equal to 1, because 10 to the first is just 10, and then log base 10 of 10 squared, or 100, is just 2, because 10 to the second is 100, right? It equals itself. Now, all, of, all that I just showed, really, is that this, the log of 1,000, which is equal to 3, does equal the log of a, so in this case the log of 10, which is 1, plus the log of b, which is just 2. And 3 equals 1 plus 2. And this is just um, related to the laws of exponents, which tell us, like in this case, if you have 10 to the third, that equals 10 to the first times 10 to the second. If you remember in this case right here, what you want to do is add your exponents. 2 and 1 is 3. And that's the logarithm is keeping track simply of what the exponents are doing. So it makes sense that the logarithms will be added because the exponents are added when you're multiplying equal bases. So I hope this helped. Again, if you're dealing, this is not a proof or anything, but if you're not sure, is this my law of log? Is this how it works? Plug numbers in until you, until you really feel like you've got a handle on it. All right, hope this helped.